many ports is the period where women reach and they don't, they can't reproduce anymore. Uh, menopause is uh, for older women when a woman tends to grow older. It's a stage that women go through whereby um, some of the most important um, feminine hormones like estrogen and progestin start to lower in their bodies and it causes, you know, a mul uh, it causes multiple changes in the body. It's a period at which your periods stop coming regularly and eventually stop coming. Menopause is a stage in a woman's life where she uh, no longer produces eggs, so she can't have children and she can't ovulate anymore. It's the stop of where you give, you stop giving back. Menopause is uh, that stage eh, where women stop getting their menses or their periods. They can't produce like ovaries so that they can have kids or something. Yeah, it's a it's an age where you like a vegetable. You reach to a level whereby you cannot have any more me menstrual cycle. I don't know the types of menopause. Nope. I don't know that at all. I don't. I don't. <laughs> no, I, I have no idea. I don't. Uh, I think that's the premenopausal stage. Premenopausal, where again, it's the period where it's your periods come, but then they're very irregular. And then now in menopause is when they completely stop coming. Yes. I research broadly on our issues that pertain to women's sexual reproductive or their rights. I just came across women who had already gone through menopause. In school and for my mother. I'm a pharmacist, so we did some basic things about menopause. My mom is kind of going through menopause right now, so I guess we're learn I'm learning through it through her perspective. School, obviously, um, biology stuff, also from uh, older aunties. I guess I learned in school. <laughs> I've like grown up around a lot of women, so I've learned about menopause through them. I would say from their late 40s to early 50s, and then maybe it'll stop um, around their 60s. Uh, over 50, 53, 52, yeah. 50? So I think for most women, it usually begins around in their 40s. So between um, late 30s, 30, um, 40s, 40s to 50s, yes. It starts around the late 40s, but it may end or like reduce, the symptoms may reduce maybe around 55, 60, yeah. 40s, but uh, of, of late, because of the changes of the food that people take, has really changed the lives of women. Okay, I'm really not sure, but I guess from the age of 40. 45 years going on, but since of genetic, whatever, these days, the kind of foods we eat, so it's kind of due earlier than 45. As early as 35 and above, because this time, I don't know, I think it's the foods we are taking. From 49. Uh, I think the stop of the menstrual periods, uh, hot flashes, Obviously, there's change of mood swings. Um. I guess headache, uh, getting tired easily, uh, back aches. Sexually, you become inactive. It depends also with your body. Hair thinning, hot flashes, mood swings. Um, your downstairs area doesn't become very lubricated very easily. I don't know how to say that in PC. The periods become irregular. Um, you'll also have um, sometimes psychological, so psychological, so some women will have like um, mood swings, um, some, other, some people have like hot flashes, um, yes. During your menstrual period you bleed a lot. Bacchic, edic, uh, then finally um, the lack of your periods.